Greetings everyone, my name is Jason Paradise Koontz and I'm the Community Manager at Ubisoft for the Toy Soldiers franchise. This video, we're going to be taking another look behind the doors of developer Signal Studios. They are hard at work on bringing the latest entry in the Toy Soldiers franchise, War Chest, to life. As a reminder, War Chest will be available in early 2015 on the Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and on PC. Now with that being said, let's take a look and see what they're up to. Here we can see a designer pathing out the exact route that flying units will take as they swoop across the battlefield. Special care is being taken to make sure units are facing the right way as they traverse the levels. Each and every wave of units in the game will need to be looked over in a similar manner. Since there are multiple waves per level, this can be quite the daunting task. The team must pay attention to the most minute of details to make every level a unique, challenging, and fun experience. For example, it wouldn't be very fair or enjoyable if a unit could travel just outside of your tower range. Likewise, each map in the game is being handcrafted by the team at Signal Studios. Even the president of the company is involved. Here's DR Albright, the creative director at Signal, placing individual assets on a map to help flesh it out. Rocks, trees, they're all being stretched, rotated, and placed into the environment to give each battleground a distinct look. More information on different maps that will be available in Toy Soldiers War Chest will be coming in the new year. So definitely stay tuned as we'll be bringing you another video on that in the near future. As always, we do want to take the time to answer a few community questions. One thing that's been popping up quite a bit is, hey, we've only seen Kaiser and Starbright's armies. Are there any more in the game? And yes, there are. If you've looked at the end of our trailers, there are a couple of silhouettes for two other armies that will be included in the game. We haven't announced what they are just yet, but we'd love to hear your thoughts on what they are. Feel free to leave your guesses about what those armies are in the comments section below. And uh, we'll definitely be peeking to see if anybody's got the answer right. As for those two armies, are they full armies or just support armies? That's another question that we've been seeing quite a bit. It is an extra two full armies, and we'll be showing off some potential footage on that in the near future. So definitely stay tuned in 2015 as more information on the game will be coming. That just about wraps it up for this video. We hope you have a happy holiday season and we'll be back in early 2015 with more videos showing you what's to come in Toy Soldiers War Chest. Take care.